Okay, as some of our schools are making the transition to um, Google Drive, I know that some of you are going to want to manage your Chromebook inventory through Google Sheets rather than using Microsoft Excel, which is perfectly fine, but we want to make sure that you have directions on how to utilize both tools. Um, and so that's what I'm about to show you now. First of all, when you're in your Google Drive, your Google Drive that's issued to you through EBR, you need to use that one because that's a secure domain. You do not use your personal because then you're moving student um, data with student names. You're moving that into an insecure site. So make sure that you're logged into your EBR drive. You'll know it's your EBR drive because it'll have the EBR logo over here in the upper left-hand corner of your drive. Once you've done that, I want to show you a couple things that you need to check before you upload. So over here in the settings, the settings gear, if you click on settings, um, right here it says convert uploads and you need to check whether or not you have this checked off and this is a personal preference but I want to explain why this is important. It says convert uploaded files to Google Docs editor format. This means when I have this box checked every file that I upload onto my drive is going to automatically be converted from a Microsoft file to a Google file and I won't have to do anything to make that happen. If I uncheck this, it's going to keep it as a Microsoft file. So when you upload your Excel file, it will um, keep it in an Excel file, even though it's stored on your Google Drive. So if you want to have it so that no matter what you upload, it always converts it to Google Docs, check that. If you're not ready to go fully that everything you upload ever is automatically converted, then uncheck this. And when you um, upload your files, they'll upload in the original format that they were in. And when you go to open them in Drive, you'll be able to switch them over if you want to. So I'm going to uncheck this just in case anybody um, isn't ready for that step so that I can show you what you'll have to do later to make it happen. So I'm going to go ahead and upload my file to my drive. I've saved mine on my desktop just for um, to find it easily. Here's my example. I'm going to open it up and you'll see here that it's uploaded. I have my green check mark so I know that it's done. It is currently an Excel spreadsheet because in my settings, when I went to settings, I told it I unchecked that. I did not want it to convert my uploaded files. Now, if I now wanted to convert them, if I check this one file, I select that by clicking on it. It's got the blue highlight, so I know it's selected. And I go here and I say um, open with Google Sheets. It's now going to convert that document for me into a Google Sheet. And so now at this point, you, you are informed, you know how to deal with it in either situation. You can do, continue to use it as an Excel spreadsheet, or you can upload it and work with it as a, um, a Google Sheet as well.